Former MDCT interim president Tokozani Kube has dismissed Douglas Monzora's claims that she has finally accepted the outcome of the Thames Chairs December 27, 2020 party extraordinary congress in which she got humiliated by some overzealous party activists cheering the now party's leader. Monzora, Kupe, Morgan Komichi and Elias Mozuri contested in election to find a new president to replace the late founding leader Morgan Changerai who died in 2018. Monzora went on to win the election but his challengers accused him of vote rigging before walking out in protest from the congress venue. However, Monzora told journalists on Tuesday that Kupe had finally seen the light and had opted for the position of first vice president after a meeting the two held. Muzuri was appointed second vice president last month while Komichi retained the national chairperson post. Yes, Dr. Kupe is working with us and we have resolved issues between us as the leadership. So next time you are going to see two vice presidents together, said Monzora, who was flanked by Muzuri. If you want to know whether she recognizes my leadership or not, she herself told me that she does recognize the leadership. And we are very happy and very excited that we have been able to resolve our internal problems very amicably. And I'm very grateful to the maturity shown by the senior leadership of the party. This is the very top leadership that was left by President Morgan Changirai, except one, Nelson Chamisa. However, Kupe took to Twitter later on, on Tuesday, and dismissed Monzora's claims. I can confirm that I met with Senator Douglas Monzora in Harare on 18th February 2021 for the first time since the 27th December 2020 Extraordinary Congress, said Kupe. The following issues were discussed. Violence, illegitimate voter law, as well as inaccurate EOC, among others. Illegal appointments in the standing committee, which are violations of the party constitutions. That the National Council held on 6 February 2021 had no mandate to alter or amend the constitution. Kupe added, my absence in today's press conference held at Morgan Richard Changirai House was informed by the need to address the aforementioned important issues to enhance the smooth running of our great movement the MDCT.